What's up guys, Chris here. Hope everybody's doing great. Still working on the Super 6 lane with our Super Loop. Not really working on it, it's working perfectly. Just picking out some cars for our event. In the meantime, I'm doing something very near and dear to my heart. Check it out. My longtime subscribers will remember a good old time when we could send in cars here to the channel. One for a stock class, one for a modified class. Race them down our scale quarter mile. Winner takes all the cars. That was a great time. That was also a time when the channel was a lot smaller. I cannot do that these days. However, there is a guy here on YouTube by the name of Marty France. Longtime subscriber, participated in the old races here on the channel, and has been hosting his own race for the past two or three years now. I've enjoyed racing over at Marty's for the last three events. By the time you guys are seeing this video, it's gonna to be too late for you to participate in this race. However, he does host this event two or three times a year. Marty also has a super six lane setup, races two cars at a time side by side, and alternates lanes each race. Without further ado, let's see what we've come up with for Marty's race. Let's see, we've got Josh with the stock class. Josh has a 1970 Chevelle metal on metal car, nice and heavy, which should work well on Marty's track. Marty's track's a little bit different than ours. A lot more downhill, a lot less flat straight away. So the heavier cars tend to do better on Marty's track. Josh's second stock entry, the Chevy Camaro IROC Z. Metal on metal, nice and heavy. And for Emmanuel, the gold school bus. Nice big casting, see how it does. And his second stock entry, the Honda Odyssey minivan. Now mine. The Combat Medic, the A on top, nice and heavy. And another Combat Medic, the Weiss Ice Teaser. Nice looking old casting. And now to the fun stuff, the Modified class. All right, Josh is up first. Of course, he comes up with something crazy the mine cart with a nut in it heavy see how it does josh's second entry equally as crazy a giant socket screwed to the skateboard we lube up all our stuff with dry lube this is what i use on the wheels for the modified class fabulous blaster the dry lube Works pretty good. So they're nice and slippery. In a modified class, anything goes. Next up, Manuel Chevelle, full of BBs. It's from the Fast and Furious era. That's a cool one. And Emmanuel's next car for the modified class, the Honda Sprocket with a socket. This looks awesome. And they're pretty good. Screwed right into the back window there. Should be a runner. And now mine. Weighing in at one pound. Semi-fast. <laughs> Look at this thing. This is just crazy. Full of BBs. Bunch of washers with a giant screw on the back. Lubed up. Thing's a good roller too. And now last but not least, the heavyweight 76. Hey, get back here. 76 Kenworth. This thing has even more washers, an even bigger screw, and probably around 75 to 100 BBs. Shoved in one by one. Lubed up. Should be a, a good roller. 
And for the entry fee, I believe we all give two cars per car that we're racing. So we've got to give a total of two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24 cars. We're going to contribute the complete set of Gran Turismo cars to the prize package. And then we got some random cool stuff. The Ford Mustang for the prize package. The Nissan Skyline. 69 Ford Torino Talladega. TV Series Batmobile. A yellow submarine. One of my favorites, a Porsche 930. The green bone shaker. I think it's pretty awesome in green. The yellow Austin minivan. The Honda monkey. 2016 Camaro SS. The blue one. The Zaymac. 72 Ford Torino Sport. The dark blue Dark Knight Batmobile. Time a taxi. Seventy three BMW race car. We have a Howlin' Heat tea hunt And last but not least, from the new car ships, the pretty hard to find Boba Fett Slave One. You know, the current reigning champ right now is Faster the Dragster with a very awesome Kenworth. I'm hoping mine will be faster. We shall see. All right, guys, if you don't want to miss the race, make sure you head over to Marty Francis' channel. Hit that subscribe button. Check out some of the previous races he has. You know, the cool thing about Marty, just a pure racer. Doesn't care about the camera angles, no fancy editing, none of that stuff. He just does what it takes to get the job done and loves racing, which I respect. The thing that's funny, every time Marty has a race, I have something else set up. And I can't test and tune the cars I built, which I guess you could say is kind of fair. So I'm just winging it with these. We'll see how they do. Good luck to all the racers, and we'll see you after the race. Hopefully we'll be bringing home the prize. Maybe not. Hey guys, thanks for checking it out. Good luck to all the racers. I got to get these things packed up and shipped. All right, guys, we'll see you. All right, we're here at the post office. We got Josh. We're going to pack up Marty's package here for the race. And we have the name. Awesome, 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 awesome. see what Josh came up with first up it's got a socket on a skateboard rolls so good it rolled right out of the camera there 
No surprise here. You come mine cart with a gigantic nut in it. Sometimes you feel like a nut, sometimes you don't. No surprise here. The mine cart with a gigantic nut in it. Josh is always a nut, so that's perfectly appropriate. And now the modified for Emmanuel. Oh, he did a sprocket with a sprocket. Honda sprocket with a sprocket in back. Got the socket screwed right in the back of that thing. And now on to my mods. First up, semi-fast. <laughs> and for the entry fee, I believe it was two cars per car that you're racing. I think it was two cars per entry. So with all the entries, we build up a nice... Uh... And for the entry fee, I believe it's two cars per... Ra and for the entry fee, I believe it's two cars... 6, 8, 10, 12... 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24 cars. Looks like I'm a little short. And here's what we're giving for the prize package. We're giving the complete set of, we're gonna give the complete set of, we're gonna, we're gonna give the complete set of Gran Turismo cars. We're gonna give the, we're gonna contribute the this is the dry lube I use for the wheels on the... This is what I use on the wheels. This is what I use on the wheels. Fabulous blaster, the dry lube. Works pretty good.